Hello, this is Vampire, and for today's video, we're going to be tackling kind of a funny question. It's funny, but it's a good question. And it is, why do Eskrima people slap themselves? All right, so this is what I'm talking about. All right, just in that short sequence, how many times did I slap myself? Quite a bit, okay? So we're going to tackle that today. I've heard some people say that we're doing this to distract people. Personally, I kind of feel like if you're going to get distracted from that, you probably have no business fighting. But if that logic makes sense to you and you're comfortable using it, why not? All right. Another explanation that I heard was that this can pump me up and also psych out my opponent, kind of like some tribal warrior dance. Once again, I say, if that seems to work for you, why not? All right, so those are some outlandish ideas, but hey, if it works for you, go for it. I'm now going to share with you reasons that I do it, okay? Uh, the first one is a follow-through, okay? So if I am striking with this hand, okay, I'm not just going to stop it here. I want to make sure that it's a nice, strong hit and it follows through. So it's just going to come right there. So that's number one. Number two is very similar to the idea in Thai boxing where it's basically the sandwich principle okay I'm bringing this person grabbing them by the head and pulling them forward and bringing my elbow okay and I want their face to blend in with my elbow okay so I'm gonna follow through just like that okay so there's a slap right there here's a vertical one that way so these is another reason right there the sandwich okay Number three is I can use it to rebound off my arm. So I'm coming in, see, I rebound off the arm and rebound off, rebound off the arm to come in with a strike. If you practice nunchucks, then you'll know what I'm talking about. The fourth reason, all right, is if I have a knife like this and this is going super fast like this, all right, I don't want this hand to get cut. I don't want to cut my own hand, and if I am utilizing this hand for strikes or pushing or whatnot, I want to make sure that this doesn't happen, okay? So if I target my own arm this way, then I know I'm safe. So, so I bring it constantly here or down here. If it's down here, you're not really going to see a slap, but if it's up here, you're going to see that, okay? So those are some of the reasons why I do the slapping, okay? Or what people call slapping. To me, I don't see it that way. It's just keeping my arms in tight and making sure that they're in the right place at the right time. Thank you for watching and take care.